A good Christmas story begins with magic. While the whole family was wrapped up in the festivities, little Marie was unwrapping her presents. Her attention was drawn to a clumsy and angular doll, the Nutcracker. Marie didn't part with her new favorite toy until late at night, taking care of him and playing pretend. Once all the family were asleep, a marvelous commotion began in the living room. All of Marie's toys, led by the Nutcracker, came to life to battle the army of the Mouse King. All of this reminded Marie of the tale of the Tough Nut, which her godfather used to tell her. The wicked Mouse Queen had bitten the newborn Princess Perlipat, transforming her into an ugly doll with a huge, stretched mouth. The court astronomer and clockmaker, following the king's orders, had to come up with a miracle to restore the princess's beauty. In their long search, they eventually found a way to break the spell. The enchantment was dispelled thanks to the magical nut presented by the charming young man to Perlipat. The princess's beauty was restored, and at that very moment, the Mouse Queen died of spite. But alas, when Perlipat touched the young man in gratitude, he transformed into an ugly nutcracker. Unable to bear such deformity, Perlipat sent the young man away. Returning from her memories, Marie gently caressed her nutcracker. She looked at the toy cupboard, which had suffered from the night battle with the mice. She felt awful that her beloved toys were not safe. Suddenly, in the middle of the night, Marie heard a nasty squeaking and creaking. The Mouse King had climbed right onto her bed and was threatening the Nutcracker. In that moment, Marie had to give up all her marzipan and sugar dolls to ransom her beloved toy from the dreadful intruder. But the valiant Nutcracker couldn't bear to see sweet Marie giving away all her treats to protect him. He borrowed a sword from the toy officer and rushed into an uneven battle with the Mouse King. The mouse crowns became Nutcracker's triumphant trophies, which he joyfully presented to Marie. The Nutcracker dreamt of showing Marie his kingdom. Through the sleeve of a coat, he managed to lead her into his doll kingdom. All the way, Marie was astonished and enchanted by the Golden Dolphins, Sugar Swan's Christmas Village, and countless other wonders of the magical land. Was it a dream or reality? Oh, everything was too magical to be true. Marie was only sure of her love for the Nutcracker, whom she couldn't find anywhere. Instead, a handsome young man appeared on the doorstep, the enchanted prince of the doll kingdom.